the most threatening moment in a man is when he cannot be able to provide. And uh, these are the moments that any lady, any girl out there must understand. Mm -hmm. That the moment a man is slow, on a job, like any, kukuwa na job si kuzema royake iwezi penda. You know, you can always, as long as you value the relationship, mm -hmm. eh, give uh, um, 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 the man a listening ear. Mm -hmm. That is, men value people that give them a listening ear. Unamuskiza, unamuliza, what happened? Men love intelligent Ladies, and being intelligent eh, is not. See, kitu ati yakupimwa, amasi kitu yamasomo. Ati that now that this one is is so learned and whatever is somebody that can be able to articulate issues. Somebody that can be able to solve problems. That somebody that can be able to you know to 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 handle issues. Any kitu kikuja mutu anaeza kudir nayo. So men atupendi mutu mwenye avikiri. that you're joining us today. My name is Martha Mora and I'm your host today and I'm joined by my fellow hosts, Wacha Atusalini. Duga Prince is here and uh, we are glad uh, with our, for our viewers. We are moving on and doing well. Mm -hmm. We are so glad and uh, ready to have you in our show. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes, and once again, we are glad to have you back and most importantly to keep on asking you to share these clips. The, the, the more you have knowledge, the more you share it, the more you can gain it and have it inside of you and most importantly for it to stick for future purposes. So we, we are asking you to follow our social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram and in all other areas for you to always be updated for there is so much more on the table for you. So today we have something good for you and of course very interesting, especially for the women. You know, very many times we have people asking, what do these men want? Because we are trying our best. We have we have done our best. And of course, we have, you know, gone from A to Z. But we are still not being found by these men we want to see. So what do men really want? And of course, we have a very, very amazing gentleman. And I represent very many good <laughs> men outside there. Trust me, you will get what you need from him. So Prince. All right, this is a, a nice and is a very juicy topic. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm here to represent our gender, mm -hmm. the male gender. Mm -hmm. And it's not easy, but um, I want to believe that um, with the, the, the short time mm -hmm. or at the time that I've been, I've been a, a, a man, or the <laughs> time that I've been a man, mm -hmm. I've learned um, uh, quite a lot mm -hmm. uh, from friends and uh, interacting also with uh, mm -hmm. uh, different uh, people. So uh, today we are ready to, uh, I'm ready to, to represent men mm -hmm. on uh, what we want, that what, what, what we really want in, uh, in a relationship, what we really want mm -hmm. in, uh, in, in a person, what we really want mm -hmm. or expect in a, in a relationship. Mm -hmm. And um, men are, are very strange beings i'll mm -hmm. start by saying that mm -hmm. and uh, why i'm saying uh, strange is because uh, men don't read minds mm -hmm. men don't read minds mm -hmm. and when talk of uh, uh, reading minds mm -hmm. uh, what i mean is um uh, men don't know how to interpret situations mm -hmm. that have not been uh, spoken out mm -hmm. so uh, we have a big uh, problem with uh, uh, ladies that want men to interpret their emotions, that want mm -hmm. men to read their minds, because mm -hmm. that is what we go for. Mm -hmm. So we have a big um, a problem with people that don't speak out. That mm -hmm. is, a, 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 you are in a relationship, uh, you, are, you, are, you, have, you are in a friendship, mm -hmm. but somebody does not speak out. I say me, an attack anini, I say me, an afikiri anini, men don't read minds. Mm -hmm. That is one of the things that I would want us to, uh, to understand from this gender that is uh, from men. So men don't read minds. For yeah. instance, we are not yet in a relationship. Mm -hmm. How do I speak out? Because I, again, as a woman, I cannot 
pick out what um, I want before we get into a serious relationship. A, a very good a question. A very good question. Now, when people are in a friendship, eh, mm-hmm. usually uh, uh, speak out on um, uh, general issues, your interests, mm-hmm. you know, uh, yeah. where what you like, you know, what you admire, your mm-hmm. hobbies. That is a general issues, you know, mm-hmm. and, and you speak about, you also share about about your life and uh, mm-hmm. your experiences, you know. Mm-hmm. You don't uh, focus on, uh, probably on what you want from mm-hmm. uh, from the person, but you should talk of your experiences, you know, your hobbies and some of the things that uh, mm-hmm. you have encountered mm-hmm. in life. Yeah. Yes. Now it's very clear. So ladies, learn to be open with uh, what you love, Yeah. how you would, die. you know, of course, when you begin to to probe these things, mm-hmm. automatically the man begins to have a picture of what you want, yeah. and they begin to know if they can actually have you as a prospect. Yeah. Yeah. So go ahead. All right. Now uh, the other issue is um, men mm-hmm. are what usually create insecurity in men mm-hmm. is uh, a personal rather a lady that uh, praises other men mm-hmm. in in the presence of uh, the man that they have. In fact, that is one of the things that usually creates a lot of insecurity in men. Mm-hmm. So we are usually very careful, women. This is to pendi compare. Mm-hmm. Men don't love competition, mm-hmm. actually. So when you are with uh, somebody that you feel you are in love with or you are in a relationship with, mm-hmm. try to avoid as much as possible mm-hmm. to talk about other men. To pendi at the, you know, I love a man who is like this and he's not like that. Praise what is there with your man. This is unapenda. You know, we, we like to be appreciated. We like to feel, you know, um, good. We like to, uh, to feel I am the man yeah. for this person. And so, of course, it, it can even um, touch on the ego. The fact that I will praise another man. Uh-huh. And I'm like, I'm here as a man. What do you mean? You uh-huh. know? Of course, ego, egotistically, I uh-huh. am endangering this man. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So that's what, is, you know, we as men now, this, uh, our gender, mm-hmm. we are very careful on, um, that is how somebody reacts, you know, how, what they usually tell you about, uh, mm-hmm. about other people. But as much as possible, men will completely be switched off by a person mm-hmm. that talks about other, other men. men. And especially their mm-hmm. successes. You know, when you're talking about their successes, mm-hmm. that means that those people are better than the, the person that you have. Mm-hmm. And uh, yeah. in this case now, somebody feels a um, belittled. So in short, if I'm in the presence of another man, uh, you will focus on who he is. Exactly. That you know, is what will actually attract that mm-hmm, man to mm-hmm. us. That one now, you know that is when, when you talk about him, you you know you encourage him, you make him feel uh, he is the man. Mm-hmm. Now he feels he feels respected, you know, he feels honored and he feels like he can take more time with you. Hey, you mama ni nagging Nagging. Men um, hate nag. Please define nagging. You know, nagging has been used eh? as a word generally, but people, people don't understand uh-huh. what nagging exactly is. Nagging. Now, basically, when we talk about a nagging, eh? uh-huh. ni okay, on in our okay from from now the definition that we have in men eh? is mutu uh, wakaki. You know, ake kuambi ya vitu, ake kuitisha vitu. Yani that is a uh, is is of a. Uh, that's a magic. Is over. A demanding. Kind a, of so person. demanding, Who eh? Who is asking and not? Yeah. You know? Who is asking, eh? Yeah. We teach a V two. We teach a V two. Every time there is there is something that they need. Every time they, there is they, an issue. They there have. is an issue they have. Yeah. Every time. You know, Anna, either they have no time for the relationship. Yeah. They have no time yeah. for for the man. Mm-hmm. It's every time kuna kitu anataka they mm-hmm. somewhere and they go pelegua kuna kitu imeenda baya mahali. You know, before you bring your issues, eh? Uh, men love, um, uh, you know, ladies as usually uh, take time uh, with them, you know, to discuss even their issues, to discuss their life, to discuss their, their, their future, you know, to discuss about uh, their relationship more than uh, the people that have always issues, you know, they want, is uh, is like, uh, the man has become the problem solver. Okay, we are problem solver, since you let them in a very serious way, but men are always switched off by people that have so many issues to bring mm-hmm. on board. Yeah, mm-hmm. I get so the, the fact that as a man you handle things one at a time, mm-hmm. bringing so many issues on board is very overwhelming. Yeah, 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 so, exactly. So yeah, and of course complaining, mm-hmm. the complaining part, you mm-hmm. need to have a balance. So it's a good thing. Yeah. You men nagging is, and sometimes it's very uncontrollable. Uh-huh. But I also feel sometimes men contribute to nagging. You know, a woman is a recipient, and yeah. I realize it's very practical. Mm-hmm. If a man keeps on, of course 
probing her to keep complaining, mm-hmm. they will. But if you treat a, a woman the way they need to be treated, trust me, they will never nag. But there are those who nag. Yeah, that's why I'm saying that um, it should be, it should be the mind, it should be get into the mind of uh, any mm-hmm. lady out there, any girl out mm-hmm. there, that uh, this one who may depend if you mm-hmm. depend if you. In fact, when 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 somebody uh, feels uh, you know this person has as a need, actually you look for a better language to express the need mm. or to express an issue. I'm a, mm. You know, uh, even uh, probably you need to request for something. Eh? Mm. You can use a better language, but make sure you start with it. Eh? You know, you, you engage, you engage more, yeah. you, put, you, you put a number of, a number of issues on mm. board before you introduce uh, the issue. Yeah. And then, uh, this is Unapenda Company. Company. We love company, and when you talk mm-hmm. about uh, loving company, we have had the issues eh, mm-hmm. of people that um, you always and you have hand of uh, people that uh, you know they are complaining that uh, uh, the, 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 the somebody has no time for the relationship, mm-hmm. the guy has no, but he has more time with friends. Mm-hmm. You know, mm-hmm. most of uh, the times uh, men don't like um, idleness; they like being engaged, mm-hmm. they like being involved, they like and uh, doing something. You know, mm-hmm. and most of of uh, most of the times, eh, you realize that uh, when they are with friends, they are doing something. Mm-hmm. They are watching soccer, you know, wanapanga kwenda swimming, wanapanga kwenda, you know, and dancing, wanapanga kwenda, you know, so many areas. Eh. Mm-hmm. So men love company, and mm-hmm. this company must be engaging enough. Yeah. So if they, a man does not find um, an engaging company mm-hmm. in a friend, or rather in a, in a person that they are dating, mm-hmm. eh, then you realize that they You'll never, they'll never have time yeah, for you. Yeah, true. You know, they, they, they value that, uh, that company that is, uh, you know, they are getting involved, there is mm-hmm. something that they are doing. Mm-hmm. And that's why uh, most of the people or most of the ladies eh, have missed out on their men and they have had time with their friends because they don't take uh, yeah. uh, some good time engaging them. Mm-hmm. So their company is not it's impressive not enough. Impressive. So I no. think what you're trying to communicate, yeah. men, one of the greatest needs of a man is friendship uh-huh. from the woman they will actually want to relate with. Because I'm um, looking at company, it means mm-hmm. this somebody or this man actually yeah. wants a friend in this woman. Mm-hmm. Can I do things with her without, you know, for instance, if your man loves football, uh-huh. do you always say you are watching this match instead of saving 24 <laughs> souls out there? Uh-huh. And you are busy watching football, you know, uh-huh. for instance, with Manu versus whatever, uh-huh. and you're telling them that is not uh, Christian like. No, when you learn what your man loves, mm-hmm. be a part of it, and yeah. you will find him spending more time with you. And mm-hmm. uh, I think I'm getting it from you right yeah. now. So mm-hmm. for ladies, I'm um, being interested in not only having romantic moments, but yeah. being a friend to this man. Mm-hmm. Find out what he loves. If he loves um, technical stuff, mm-hmm. when he's going there, carry your picnic bag and tell him, wherever you are going, I am going as long as I am doing what you need to do. So uh, men love company and friendship. Yeah, uh, that is that is very true. Mm-hmm. Then, uh, kuna an- another issue still on men, eh? mm-hmm. where uh, unapata mwanaume amepatikana, mm-hmm. amepatikana. Ama umeambiwa, mm. nilimuona, ama nilimusikia mm-hmm. with, uh, you know, some, with somebody, ama, you know, especially when people are dating, you still have uh, friends, mm-hmm. so you're still engaging the friends, you're still doing things, eh? mm-hmm. then umepata mwanaume on issues of cheating. Mm-hmm. Men don't like being confronted mm-hmm. with very harsh words. You can do it, um, okay, ladies can do it in a better way. And when talk of uh, uh, doing it in a better way, and on this respect, I am not encouraging uh, men to cheat. Uh, what I want to talk is uh, that when uh, probably you are a man or a guy that you are dating, eh, you realize that has been involved in uh, uh, something. Ama ume, ume, ume skia. Mm. Don't, number one, don't dwell on rumors. Eh? Mm. Ya kuataka baka unamutumia text mrefu hapo, mm. unamuambia mimi kwanza hata tumemalizana, you know, that kind of a thing. Sizi ni audio, zinakuatana zaote. Eh, hey, zinakuatana hapo, umemushia maneno hapo, unamuambia, hey, mimi wewe, sasa mamba ya kwata tumemaliza. You know, you can always, as long as you value the relationship, mm. eh, give uh, um, 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 the man a listening ear. Mm. That is, men value people that give them a listening ear. Mm. Unamusikiza, unamuliza, what happened? Mm. A man will totally be naked and express themselves and even apologize. Like you know, you come na yeye atakuwa mwanaume. Ato inaweza kuwa sasa sasa umekuwa umekuwa so harsh, umekuwa so tough. Sasa una unataka unamwonyesha unataka kumalizana. Tena basi yatumalizane. Yeah. And I think what you're saying is true. You know, yeah. There's somebody who said, you know, we think men cheat 
more but we'll realize actually women cheat more mm. I mean at men <laughs> wana patikana na kushinda wana uh-huh. <laughs> you know men like you're saying it's very uh-huh. true when they are confronted yeah. they can be easily open because it's so hard for them to uh, be able to handle two situations yeah and exactly you're right. you're right but, uh, so i think what you're saying is true and i think it applies in any issue even in a relationship apart from uh-huh. cheating when you're confronting that that person mm-hmm. on a mistake they have made how yeah. do you confront them is mm-hmm. it with a lot of respect and honor mm-hmm. as you try to help them um, see you are hurt yeah. and you want to find a solution because some of these times like you're saying some of them are rumors mm-hmm. not even true mm-hmm. and you confront anyone even if they have done a wrong they become yeah. defensive yeah. so it's important to to of course uh, and of course as a fellow man has said women outside there we are telling you um confront this man and especially when they have the this specific issue cheating uh, um respect yourself enough don't don't like for me it's, a, it's all about respecting yourself uh, why don't i go and just understand it is him who has done it uh-huh. then of course come later and approach the issue in a very peaceful manner however bad it is apo uno na on that eh? mm. on that what what we usually now what men want you know today we sisi sisi wanaume tunapendanga nini uno na even i want to, to to speak to our ladies eh? mm. that wakati mwanaume tuseme amekuwa involved in um, uh, cheating ama you have umepata rumors kama hiyo eh? mm. in fact ukienda we enda tu muengage kama hakuna kitu unajua mm. then in the process eh? unamwambia yeye na kuna kitu nimesikia bwana about you from so and so and then usifanye ni kama ni kitu kubwa sana just make mm. it simple eh hata kama inakuuma hiyo mm. unasema ah hiyo mtu anataka kuchukuliwa yeah, yeah make, make it ikae ni kama ni kitu hata injakuuma unaona na akianza kujitetea mambi mimi nilitaka i want us to nataka tuianga i want us to look at it eh? mm-hmm. and then tuone vile tunaweza kusaidiana hii kitu yeah. <laughs> ishe sure. you know men wanataka wa watu you know somebody who is uh, intelligent enough okay mm-hmm. men love intelligent ladies and being mm-hmm. intelligent eh, is not a uh, siki tu ati ya kupimwa ama siki tu ya masomo ati yeah. now that this one is is so learned and whatever is somebody that can be able to articulate issues somebody that can be able to solve problems that somebody that can be able to you know to 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 handle issues yani kitu kikuja mtu anaweza ku deal nayo so men atupendi mtu mwenye afikiri in fact you will find that a, a man will even take ladies when wa kunywa na huko afanye vitu but at the end of the day atawa mwanamke mwenye yako na akili we are very careful at least msichana who is decent and sober mtu mwenye anaonekana anafikiria and that's why i usually i usually um uh, speaking to our ladies eh, and tunawaambia that uh, be careful how you deal with your man let your man see that uh, you are sharp enough at yeah. least unaelewa vitu you can be able to you know you can be as as a bila watu nasema that this lady when you get married eh, mm. should become the manager of the house yeah. you need somebody a good manager you need a smart yeah, manager be able to do yes. things through and come you know from uh-huh. the start to the end without a lot of issues that's what even actually uh-huh. I choose one example from the bible what yeah. attracted david to abigail mm-hmm. it was the brains yeah. and you see maybe there are other women outside there who feel like brains are not important mm-hmm. you will just attract a man who is the same and mm-hmm. you will do life like that but if you have brains you will attract a king yeah. just like abigail <laughs> did yeah right mm-hmm. the most threatening moment mm-hmm. in a man mm-hmm. is when he cannot be able to provide mm-hmm. and uh, these are the moments that any lady any girl out there must understand mm-hmm. that the moment a man is slow on a job lakini kukuwa na job si kusema roho yake iwezi penda you know the moment that uh, okay somebody cannot provide ana pesa you know he cannot afford to take you out he cannot afford to buy some ice cream he cannot afford to uh, do so many other, do some road trip and uh, the rest eh? mm-hmm. that does not mean that they, he cannot love so this kind of moment ladies must understand a jobless man can fall in love yeah. you know na anaweza kuwa ana pesa ana ka kitu lakini sasa these ladies eh, must understand ama ama maelewe that i need to uh, get into this, the life of this guy eh, mm-hmm. na nisimweke demand sa vitu zenye hawezi afford yes. so hapo nasema men look for understanding ladies yeah. tisi najua huyu jamaa 
anaweza kuwa fond lollipop unaona that's so he can afford <laughs> you know sasa hiana kitu in fact hata pea akikuja amekopa pengine amekopa because he had to meet me try to limit some of those uh, some of those um, issues that probably may make the man to feel that uh, i'm not adequate enough yeah. naambia nipeleke huku nifanyie hivi yeah. okay you lady is like requesting for so many things eh? but check if a man cannot provide that is a very threatening moment yeah. to the man and of course men love acceptance so you yeah. can accept them for who they are and how mm-hmm. they are that, at that particular moment is very hard however mm-hmm. again we need men who are working hard who we can see they are going somewhere and of course um we don't marry potential we marry patterns mm-hmm. because we need to see somebody who in the next few years yeah. i'm sure even if they are the lowest moment yeah. we are going to be growing and getting to the places where we need mm-hmm. to be so i think um we can uh, give our last points okay. our time is almost up All right. So we can talk so much about a uh, man because um but we are just uh, uh, doing an, a summary of of what women want eh? mm-hmm. that uh, there, there is something um as men go by what they see. Mm-hmm. So uh, we always men like attractive things. Mm-hmm. That's why utakuwa unatembea na mwanamume wako then msichana very smart apite atamzindikiza tu na macho kidogo hivi alafu arundi kwako. Now because men move by what uh, they see. Mm-hmm. I talk of dress attractively mm-hmm. be decent in your dressings eh? mm-hmm. not being uh, exposed those that are exposed are meant for outing but mm-hmm. somebody that is meant for those is decent mm-hmm. you know akuna mtu atapenda mtu atiako so exposed because i was so exposed atakuwa for everybody mm-hmm. but when you are decent you are decent for one person so mm-hmm. you dress attractively uh, so that you can be able to you know a man can be proud of you body is not an issue hii mambo at this year me and wait you in 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 when unaweza kuwa ume and wait but you are very smart yeah. you know you have dressed smart lakini like, unaweza kuwa ume and wait lakini hata dressing yako ina switch off at the man so men are very careful with uh, attractive people you know wow. people that have dressed more they are the modest and, mm. and attractive wow so yeah. good ladies and of course you can give your final remarks as a man in this place Okay we are glad and um, uh, we love to uh, to engage and uh, uh, do more it has been good and uh, to our ladies out there understand what you a man want because we are different we are we are created differently mm-hmm. probably what i want is not what the other person want mm-hmm. this other person so learn to understand your man and that will help you to move faster in your relationship mm-hmm. Wow, so you've had a number of things and I believe it's a very 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 key thing. So we leave it up to you guys and of course as the men have spoken and he has spoken on behalf of very many men listen listen carefully. Thank you very much for joining us this evening, morning, wherever you're watching us from and we are glad that you're always part of this show. Welcome every Tuesday and Prima TV on all social media platforms.